In 1952, the first international event was held when a small team from the Netherlands came to compete. From this date, Popper, as he was endearingly known, referred to the Games as the Olympics of the Disabled. How important are games like these to paraplegics? Very important, see, from both the physical and psychological point of view, but uh, the most important is from the point of uh, the, uh, the social reintegration of the paralyzed into society. The 1960 event is widely thought of as the first Paralympic Games, being held overseas for the first time, just after the Olympics in Rome. 400 paralyzed men and women took part representing 24 countries. From this point on, an annual event was held at Stoke Mandeville, and in each Olympic year, the Games moved, in the hope that they would be held in the Olympic city. My first ever Paralympic Games was Tokyo, and I was lucky enough to come back with two gold medals, including the first ever track event. The Paralympic movement continued to grow. Papa Goodman would have loved to have been here now. He had an extraordinary idea, and from that small acorn in Stoke Mandeville, we're now going to have 4,200 athletes from 165 nations competing in the London 2012 Paralympic Games. That's an awesome journey in just 64 years.